a very pretty snake. You can see through his body, or maybe you can't in that light. When he expands with air, the blue in between the scales, there he goes, he's trying to be fierce again. <laughs> There's my little mate, a little green tree snake. He's going to come and say hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. Shame about the light, though, isn't it? Isn't that little fella? It's a shame about the light. I still can't hear you. Got to get him in the light is what I got to do. I got to get him in the light is what I got to do, and not let him musk all over me. Yeah, that's the boy. That's the boy. That's better in the light, isn't it? Isn't it, little fella? The last time one of these musked on me, it stunk for days. I couldn't wash it off. And the last time I caught one of them and it musked all over me, I couldn't wash the smell off for days. They stink. This is a common tree snake, quite common. It's the second attempt I've had at him today. First attempt, he disappeared into the trees. This time, he was a bit easier to catch. If we look along his body here, this little lump that you can see, it's worms, he's got worms. Well, they don't do much damage. A little bit of a parasite. A very pretty snake. You can see through his body, or maybe you can't in that light. When he expands with air, the blue in between the scales, there he goes, he's trying to be fierce again. Shaking with a bit of adrenaline. That catching snakes always gives you. Massive eyes catch his prey with and now he's climbing on me and I'm gonna let him go let him go to his thing into the shadows it goes ah oh, far out he did musk on me damn it and I've lost him in the bush there you go another green tree snake Another handful of stink. I'm going to go and try and wash that off. Thanks for stopping by. I'll check his.